Measuring Angles In this module, you will learn measuring angles using a protractor. Sid is sitting on the floor. He got a semicircle shaped object. He was guessing about this object. Then his mother comes. She tells him that it is a protractor. It is used to measure angles. It has two edges, a circular edge and a straight edge. The circular edge has two scales, outer and inner. The outer scale is marked from 0 to 180 in a clockwise direction. The inner scale is marked from 0 to 180 in an anti-clockwise direction. One mark represents 1 degree and is written as 1 degree. In all, there are 180 divisions, so it is called 180 degrees. The line segment joining 0 and 180 is called the baseline, bottom line of the protractor. The midpoint of the baseline is called the center of the protractor. Now let us measure an angle. Place the center of protractor on the vertex of the angle. Adjust the protractor such that the baseline falls along one arm of the angle. Read the mark on the protractor where the other arm crosses the scale on the protractor. Here, angle AOB is 70 degrees. We can also use a protractor to define the types of angles. Acute angle. Acute angle measures less than 90 degrees. Right angle. Right angle measures equal to 90 degrees. Obtuse angle measures greater than 90 degrees but less than 180 degrees. Straight angle. Straight angle measures equal to 180 degrees. Let's recap. A protractor is an instrument used to measure angles. Acute angle measures less than 90 degrees. Right angle measures equal to 90 degrees. Obtuse angle measures greater than 90 degrees but less than 180 degrees. Straight angle measures equal to 180 degrees.